Welcome everybody to our fifth installment of my Mixin' Mondays. It's the boy, Dak908, the Dig Dugger himself. I don't know what the himself part is. Is the Dig Dugger himself a name altogether or just himself as me as I'm explaining to us? I don't know. It's the Dig Dugger, Dak908. Welcome to Majora's Mask. Uh, for newcomers, I know you guys are like, what the hell is he talking about? Well, anyway, um, let's get to the business. Now, what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to play the song of time backwards so I can slow down time. Uh, I never get around the first try, so let's see if I can. Wait, wait. There we go, okay. I, it's, ugh, whatever, I don't know. But... In my previous video, everyone's like, hey, do the side quest. I said, okay, let's do the side quest, because, um, you know, technically, through the story, I'm blazing through this. I can beat this game in, like, five parts, okay? But I'm not going to. I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to do the side quest. I'm going to make the game fun. I'm going to have some fun with this. So what we got to do, um, let's go get the bomber's notebook. That's very important. You need the bomber's notebook in order to do your side quest. Uh, well, not, I don't know if to, in order to do them, I think you can do them without the Bomber's Notebook. Oh, let me turn this down. It's kind of loud in my head. Okay, just enough so I can hear it. Um, but, well, I just made a big Yui. It's actually this way. It's actually up around the other way, but I'm going to go this way to get the same way. But, uh, the Bomber's Notebook has all the little side quests in it. You can do the side quests, you know, to help people, make them happy, all that kind of thing. It's, it's, it's a weird thing, but it has... Uh, basically a list of all the people you can help all the people you can help and those are all the side quests so we're, we're blah. I can't talk today I don't know I've, I've done this I've tried to do this commentary four times already um keep being keep getting disrupted -ed. and now I kind of like lost I've technically I've lost will to do this commentary but I'm going to stomach through it we're gonna you know push our way through we're gonna get the job done but again you what you have to do talk to this little young whippersnapper after you blow up the balloon uh you guys are basically playing hide and go seek or tag or whatever wait hide and go seek is tag it's just you're hiding first then it's tag but anyway um there's two kids around here what i like to do is um um well, you can get them into the impossible corners like that because the game is stupid. It, it recognizes that it's a wall there and it's a wall there and then the air is trying to run away from you so it like confuses itself and doesn't know where to go. Or you can get the drop on them like that. Like they don't really see you coming. You just quick roll because the roll is quick. Er, then just run. I don't know if the Deku kid bomb, the, like, you need to put the Deku mask on. I don't know if you're faster. Let's find out. Do you think you're faster? No, I don't think it'll count. Because, um, you have to be a kid. Like a boy. A real boy! But this is one thing that the game likes to do. Um, see, how, see, see where he is? If I go too far in there, I'll be in the next, uh, section. But, um, if you stand right here, if you were just right, he'll, like, run into you. Bam! Just like that. That's a little trick I learned from years of experience. Um, then we got this kid. He sometimes just runs off the balcony. There he is. All right. Run, run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm black. Cause it's true. Whoa! Almost. Dang it! Little fucker. No, I don't want to know what's the beach. You don't get all that. Oh, actually, yeah, oh, okay. Anyway, um, next. Wait, we don't have the hook shot yet. Nope, not yet. Eventually, I'll show you how to get more money. Um, it's a little trick, so to speak. That a lot of people like to do. I just went the wrong way. But the last kid, he's in the uh, I think they call it the wash area. So to speak, I think I'm, 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 if I'm not mistaken, he's there, or he could just be in the West Clock Town. Let's check West Clock Town first before we check down there. Uh, but you get all five of oh, there he is. I knew it, West Clock Town. But you get all five of the kids. Bam, got him. 
When you get all five of the kids, they turn around because there's numbers on their backs. Um, and they give you the password to get into the, what is it, the, their secret base. And they give you, also give you a, uh, a bomber's notebook, is what you need for the side quest. So, they're talking about how the little lost kid is a bad guy, and then they give you the bomber's notebook. Pleasant. Delicious. Alright. Okay, yeah. Blah, 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 20 people. Blah, blah, blah. Don't forget the rules. Hit code. One, two, three, four, five. That's not the code. Yeah, it's always. Yeah. Well, oh, wait. What? Oh, okay. They just turn their backs in a numerical order, but the. Okay, that's them. Anyway. Two, five, four, three, one. You don't have to remember that. Because we're not going over there. Alright, now the bomber's notebook. It's displayed here. Now, all the people that you, you, you... When you talk to random people, some people might have problems, and then their problems will be recorded in the bomber's notebook. And then you can, um... You know, assist them in any which way possible. Now, one... <sighs> excuse me. One that I like to do. Uh, it's a simple one. Is, uh... Around midnight, well, around nighttime, in this area, uh, some guy will try to rock, will try to mug this old lady. She comes through here, and then, uh, well, and then uh, you stop him, and you get a bomb mask. Now, if you look here, I don't have any masks. All I have is this one. I showed you guys how to do that one. Wait, did I? I don't know. If not, I'm gonna show you later, cause I don't. Not right now. And I have the story mask. Um, and no other mask, but the bomber's notebook allows you to fill up your library with, well, fill up your th thing with masks, so you can progress. Now we're gonna skip to night time because that's where we'll want to catch our first mask. It's a quick one because all I gotta do is stop the guy, and bam, you get the mask. Um, to really fill this up, you have to talk to a large amount of people, like uh, the mayor's. The mayor, I think the mayor's wife, a bunch of people. Uh, we'll get to that. But first and foremost, let's. I think we have to talk to that bomber guy. Or well, the guy in the bomb shop. Because they'll be like, hey, I'm supposed to be getting a shipment in, but mom ain't come in yet, or something like that. Um, let's go talk to him. Wait. West Clock Town. West Club. I don't think it was the other way. We're north. This is north. I don't know. The, the cardinal directions it just... It's not happening for me right now. It's not. This should be west. West. Excuse me. I'm thirsty. Fat drink time. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Um, remember that mask I showed you guys? Okay. These... Wait, first we gotta talk to him. Don't bother us. Bam, the Rose Sisters, Twin Dancers, at your notebook. Just like that, that's all it takes. Talk to somebody with a problem, and um, you fix their problem, and then they, it's noted in the uh, the uh, Bomber's Notebook. Now their problem is, their dance sucks. Like, look at that, like, it's, it's like, mm, ugh. And then, uh, some little weird thing, like Hulk Hogan, I don't know. Don't bother us, well guess what? Check this out. You throw this mask on, and then you start the dancing process. Wait, wait, wait. There you go. Yeah. Apparently, I teleported behind them, but that's cool too. You know, that's that's just fun. But yeah, you, you show them this dance. Everybody joins in. It's a cooler dance than what they were doing before, because it's an actual dance they was doing before. It's kind of weird and not very dancey at all. But uh, if you don't get a mask through the whole ordeal, you'll get something nice. In this particular instance, you'll get a heart container. And that's nice because I actually need one piece. One more piece and then I get another full heart, which is delicious. <laughs> Bam. Okay, there we go. Congratulations. Yay, master, you're so cool. Bam. I got my heart. Is that a full heart? Yeah. Okay, but yeah, see? 
That's just about. You talk to people, they have problems, you hook them up. Um, now, I think this is the bomb shop. I think, I'm not sure. If anything, I talk to this guy anyway. But, excuse me. Hi! <laughs> uh, hero shield. Got on his side, nothing. I think we talk to him when there's this night job shop. That's when you have to do it. Because everything's time based. Every ride has different. Wait. Might that be the. Is it? No, he. Alright. He will leave this shop to go to that shop. It's a curiosity shop. Uh, he sells illegal things that are sold there. Now, um, if that guy succeeds in stealing the bomb bag. You, uh, not the, yeah, the bomb mask or whatever, you got to buy it over there. Talk to shopkeeper, we were expecting to get our larger bag pretty soon. I don't think about it, it's already late. See, that's what they're talking about. Uh, it being late, you have to go and find the old lady and protect her. Now, what time exactly the, the big bad wolf comes and stalks the prey? I can't remember, I think it's actually like 9 o'clock. So, what I'll do is, um, for the self, for the preservation of time, <clears throat> I won't actually stop the recording because I need to record it because it's one of those quick situation things. But <sighs> to throw a little, to throw a little mind fuckery into your little spatili there, I'll edit the whole thing to where you guys don't even notice the wait. It'll just be I'm there. It happens. It doesn't happen. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Um, where is that guy, though? I think he's, like, creeping, like, over here somewhere. Where is he? Yep, see, there he is. He's a creeper. Yeah, if you talk to him, he'll be like, oh, no, I gotta run away. Um, but he plays, a, he plays another role in this game much later for a different, uh, for a different reason. You see him again. It's another side quest, but it's like the main side quest. Like, you know, have all these mediocre halfway side quests. He'll play a part in the main side quest. I mean, the side quest is long. You must practically have already beaten the game to even do the side quest correctly because it spans out to so many locations. You need so many tools to get the job done, and it's just a lot of crap. But, uh, this is what we're gonna do. I'm going to sit here and wait. You guys are not going to know that I'm here. So, um, I'm going to start it now, and then when, when we're all done with the whole shebang, uh, we'll, we'll cut right into it. So, enjoy the wait, which won't be done for you, but I'll have to enjoy a long wait. Hold your breath. Okay, so, we're back. Um... Apparently it was right at midnight, not nine o'clock. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to play. I sped up the. I didn't speed up the time. I set the time back to normal. We're going. What we are going to do? We're going to slow it back down again. What that does is it uh, actually slows the movements of the uh, the people. So he won't be able to lickety split run away with the goods because I'll have to get it up on him because I'm still moving lickety split. He's moving like a slug in molasses uphill. See? See? See that? See that? Move. See that's grandma right there. Grandma's moving extra crispy slow. Now what we have to wait for is we have to wait for the cutscene to happen. The cutscene happened, the guy he'll prance up. They call him the dancing man. But um he prances up to y'all gaily like and then you have to run and catch him, chase him down, beat him up, she gives you the mask, you go buy the big bomb bag, everybody's happy. And then I'll be the first quest. I'll probably cut at this one. It'll be a relatively short period, but uh I wanna go and talk to more people. So we have more quests to do. And here's the sequence. The dancing man, he'll prance his way up. See him? He's all la 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 la. Gay, 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 look at me. Running, 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 running. Look at my silly hand. Dancy, 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 dancy. Give me a chance, bitch. And that's what he say. Ouch, watch out. Stop, thief. I'll show you. What's the deuce? Oh, that boy. 
I almost didn't get it. You lit it? Ugh. Since you didn't take any off with the blah, can stock the bomb bag at the shop. Put them out tomorrow. Here, yes, thank you. It's the fly the pie out. You get the blast mask. With it, you have bombs, but you must sacrifice your life. Same thing. Press the B button, you blow, look at you split up. And that's how you get it done. That's the first mask that you guys will that I'm going to show you guys in this LP session. I know it was kind of short, but um I wanna go and like find a few more people, then we can all tackle all those together. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you haven't, sorry, probably because the commentary isn't that good. Then again, it's because your boy's kinda of feeling a little bit down in the diggity dumps. So maybe the next one will be a bit more ebonic, fluid, and more fly tastically slickety diggity. I'll let you boy.